Imagine discovering your picture on someone else's social media site or finding a person pretending to be you. It's known as digital kidnapping. Not in your sides, Carlos Herrera has more on this new trend that may affect your social media habits. Just when many thought the internet couldn't get any creepier, Another alarming trend. People just want to keep posting, just doing things, and they think they get caught up in the social media storm, and they just, it's almost automatic. Yep, games and fantasies played with other people's photos. It's called digital kidnapping. It's a difficult, difficult thing to think about. No one wants to ever have the thought that, you know, just posting instantly a picture on the uh, internet or the web would then cause other issues to be utilized by someone else. A frightening situation to be put in for anyone to learn their picture is being used by someone else on social media platforms or even dating sites. You can go through different emotions. The victims will go through anger, they'll go through denial, they'll go through a lot of issues with not understanding how this could possibly happen. And then there's the other problem, getting that picture removed. There are some rights that are guaranteed to people, but they're not 100%. Something that experts say can be nearly impossible to do. In many cases, the photo is shared numerous times in social media websites. At Facebook, our goal is to create a welcoming and safe environment. And tracking down the original kidnapper or even the owner can be tricky. And in some occasions, the case can be much more complex. Sometimes we've had incidents where people have actually then blocked the uh, original owners of the photographs from the websites and then maintain those photographs and then they have to go through a process to prove to the uh, social media provider that that photograph is in fact theirs. Well, the FBI says there are a number of things you can do to protect your images, but even that doesn't completely guarantee that your images will be safe. Experts say if you don't want a photo stolen, don't post them. But if you can't stay away from sharing photos on social media, they advise you use the strictest privacy settings, which can prevent people from stealing photos or download free apps or use a website that allows you to put a watermark on your images. So before you share your selfies on Facebook, Instagram, or Snapchat, just remember those photos can be used for public usage and that they can be digitally hijacked. You may want to take the necessary precautions before this disturbing trend forces you to change your social media habits. Carlos Herrera, Kagan 9, on your side. Something to think about, isn't That's it? Right.